ring shed. On the floor, a down buff. So Sherrod picks up that foul. Oh, Sadler is down. She hit the deck hard. After that missed shot by Hollingshed, the momentum of all the teams was going the other way to be in transition. Hollingshed missed the shot. Take a look at Sadler. She's on the left-hand side of your screen. Oh, and her own teammate, Tutelli, just bumped into her from behind. You did not see, mm, you know, like a huge impact, and yet Sadler remains on the floor. And that was just so unlucky. She does in warm-ups and in training and at shoot-arounds. I have seen her wear a back brace. And she has been a huge mm. factor for this Colorado club. She and Miller transferring over to Colorado from Washington. She's got the five points right now. Sadler has seven, seven points. And in the first game in February 6th, Sadler had 16 minutes and only scored two points. Sadler right now, 19 minutes in this matchup, seven points. She's shooting 50% from the field. She's been critical with ball handling. She's been great at passing. She's got two assists, and she's taking care of the ball. No turnovers. So coming up next, we will send it out to Ashley, Elise, and Roz for the Tums game break. And they are going to have mm -hmm. a lot to break down when it comes to this one. But right now, we're just worried about Sadler, who remains on the floor. They're going to take every precaution with Sadler. This arena has fallen silent. Yep. Colorado huddling on the court with J.R. Payne in the bench on its feet. The Buffs going for their first tournament win in the first five seasons under J.R. Payne. Mm. Sadler was having such an impactful fourth quarter. J.R. Payne now out, kneeling down next to Sadler, and they're gonna take every precaution here, as they should, to be very mindful. And this is tough to see, and there's J.R. Payne, who is just consoling Sadler. So that is the scene here at Michelob Ultra Arena. Sadler is alert and speaking. Uh, her, her father is actually climbing over the fence there or the gate. And now um, he's wearing a gray hooded sweatshirt in the top right and likely will wait for her in the tunnel. Heart-wrenching, gut-wrenching. Sadler fell awkwardly and has remained on the floor. Just grateful, as we all are, that the team of experts is in place. There's Sadler's father to take care of Sadler uh, with great care. And <laughs> Tamiya Sadler will be taken away on the stretcher. Her father joining Tamiya on the floor right now. She will be wheeled off by the medics and EMTs, and you can't help but wonder, 
What is going through the heads and hearts of Sadler's teammates? With this game in the balance, and right now all they can care about is her, is their friend and teammate. As they all come over to greet her as she is wheeled off in a very nice show of incredible support from everybody here, no matter what team you're with. Gosh, I mean, these Washington Huskies, a lot of them played with Sadler when she was playing for Washington before transferring to Colorado. And Sherrod is in tears. She's got to get it together. Tutelli in tears. There's Jalen. She basically had to use her jersey to wipe away the tears. And now you've got to collect yourself, Tammy. So important. You know, as, as, as J.R. Payne says, it's business as usual. we got to take care of business. But you're asking yourselves to do an awful lot when your teammate goes off on a stretcher. 